Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be doing a wet test on a sunscreen from Target, and it is the native sunscreen. So I hope you guys enjoy today's content. If you do, please give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel so I can create more contents like this. So this is a native sunscreen. It is SPF 30 and it only has zinc oxide in here. And let's open this package up. And this is how the bottle looks like. It doesn't have any tint and no fragrance. And this is how the sunscreen looks like. This is pretty thick. It looks very silky. It took a little bit of effort to blend the sunscreen into my skin and the sunscreen feels pretty kind of sticky on my skin but I'm going to apply another layer to see if it's going to peel There's definitely a prominent white cast on my skin and it feels pretty sticky and the sunscreen is definitely not too matte and not too dewy. So I'm going to wear the sunscreen for the rest of the day and see how it does. It has been one hour and my face is getting oily. The sunscreen is definitely not made for oily skin and also the stickiness of the sunscreen is still there and so it's not something I enjoy um, so we'll see. It has been 10 hours and this is how my skin looks like. Now this sunscreen is not super oily for my oily skin. It is not drying and also it doesn't irritate my eyes. Uh, but I don't like it just because the white cast is pretty prominent. But mostly because the formula is pretty sticky on my skin. So I don't like that feeling. And plus, I don't feel like the sunscreen is cohesive. Every time I reapply the sunscreen, it does take a little bit of work and time to kind of blend in the sunscreen. In comparison to another sunscreen I bought from Target, this is the Bliss sunscreen. This one has zinc oxide and titanium dioxide and is an invisible sunscreen. And I remember really liking the sunscreen because the sunscreen has a little bit of a tint and so it masks away that white cast and the finish is not too oily, not too matte The finish of the Bliss sunscreen looks a lot better than the finish of the native sunscreen because of the tint so it automatically looks a lot better because it blends through my skin better and also it's more silkier, it's more cohesive uh, versus the native sunscreen here, it's kind of patchy compared to the Bliss sunscreen. I have looked at so many sunscreens at Target lately. This is the best sunscreen so far that I have tried. So that's it for today. Give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, comment down below. All that really helps out my YouTube algorithm and that really helps me to create more contents. So like always, thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you next time. Bye. Mommy, mommy. Yes. I don't want my apple juice. Shake the apple juice. <gasps> what? Who drank it? <laughs> no way. Yes, way. No way. You drank yes, the whole way. thing? Yeah. No way. Yes, way. Okay.